Hello everyone, it's me JB from Unique Tutorials. Today, in this video, I'm gonna compare Extreme Download Manager with Internet Download Manager. So, without further more delay, let's begin. So, here I'm gonna divide into five different sections. So, I will discuss it one by one. So, the first section will discuss about which operating system it support. So let us open any web browser and in the Google search just let us search for Extreme Download Manager firstly and we'll go to the its official website Extreme Download Manager right so you can see on the first list so just let us visit to its official website and find out which operating system it supports so just scroll down below now here you will see our tons of download options right so you can see here download option is available for windows linux mac os and even for other versions like the java files so that means it almost support every operating system available for the respective computers like whether if you're using a linux also this extreme download manager or the xdm is available for linux for mac os as well as for the windows computer so if you're using any one of this operating system on your respective computer then you are good to go so let us find out about the internet download manager which operating system it supports so once again open any web browser and in the google search just search for internet download manager and you can see on the first list internet download manager's official website just click on it so you can see here a download options on the right top corner right you can just click on it and you can just download it but the sad part is that this internet download manager is only available for windows computer so this internet download manager which is also known as idm is not available for linux as well as mac os so if you are a windows which user then you can definitely download and install it so this is all about which operating system part of this download manager supports so now on the second sections we're gonna find out is it free or paid or trial so once again just let us open its official website to find out if it's free or paid or trial so right now you can see here when you go to the this download options in the extreme download manager official website it is totally free of course and the good thing is that it's an open source download manager so extreme download manager is completely free of course so you don't need to purchase anything so a good thing about the extreme download manager now you can see in case of the internet download manager you can see in the official website it's already mentioned that try idm 30 days free trial so this internet download manager or the idm is not completely free so it's only available as a trial version so you can use it 30 days free trial then after that you need to purchase this idm so on the third section we'll try to find out does it have web browser plugin so let us find out just open any web browser and now just search for this name as extreme download manager chrome right now i'm using a chrome web browser so if you're using a firefox then just type instead of chrome firefox and if you're using a microsoft edge then just type microsoft edge so you can see here on the first list extreme download manager so it will take you to the chrome web store so you can see here let us click on it so finally you can see your extreme download manager plugin is available for google chrome and it is also available for mozilla firefox as well as for microsoft edge also so if you find difficulty in finding this plugin download links then there is one more way just open the extreme download manager and once you open this you can see here option name as tools right just click on this tools and you can see you can click on this browser monitoring so you can see here it's available for Mozilla Firefox Google Chrome Opera Chromium Vivaldi Microsoft Edge so if you are not getting a download link even if you search on the Google search then you can just click on it and you will be provided with the direct plugin download link and you can just copy and paste it on your respective browser to install this respective 
Download Manager plugin for your respective web browser. In case of IDM or the Internet Download Manager, once you install it, it will automatically install the plugins that is compatible with the respective web browser. So if you are using a Google Chrome or Mozilla Firefox or Microsoft Edge, it will automatically try to install the browser plugins also. So let me open this Google Chrome web browser and you can see in the Google Chrome, you can see one extension icon, right? So just click on it. Now you can see your IDM integral integration module, right? You can just pin it to enable this one. So you can see here, that means the internet download manager plugin is also available for almost all the popular or the most commonly used web browsers. So on the fourth section, we'll try to know, does it have floating forward video or music downloading options? So you can see here, before I start playing this video, you will see here tons of pop-ups downloading options. So you can see here, it's for IDM, right? It is for the Internet Download Manager. If you click on this pop-up, there will be a tons of download options for this respective video file. And you can see on the right bottom corner also, there is a download options from the Extreme Download Manager. Once you click here, you can see a tons of download options. So both of this Download Manager has the similar floating pop-up video and music downloading options. So on the fifth section, we'll try to find out how is the download speed and does it have a pause or resume downloading options. So right now you can see a video here again, right? So you can see already a pop-up. So let us try to download it using a IDM. So let us try to download it. So it's very quick, right? So let us do the same thing with the extreme download manager download options. So let us try to download this. Also providing a very good download speed, right? So let us try to pause it and let us try to resume it again. So it's really working. So it has a pause and resume option also. And similarly, the IDM2 has a pause and resume options. So you can pause it in case of the IDM also, and you can just resume it again. So comparing the two, I come to the conclusions that both are almost a very capable download managers. If you compare side by side, about the IDM as well as the XDM that is the extreme download manager as well as the internet download manager so in my point of view which is better right so it's very difficult for me to find out the exact cost of which is better but if you need a free download manager with a multi operating system support then I will highly recommend to go for the extreme download manager but if you want a uh, more speed then i will highly recommend to go for the internet download manager so this is the topmost point i would like to share you about the extreme download manager or internet download manager so if you have any doubts regarding this two download managers then you can drop your questions below in the comment sections i will try my best to help and guide you with your problems so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching